What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of Get Out Fishing. We are not bass fishing today as you can tell. I am down here at the coast in Swansboro. My buddy RD up there working the cast net and we are hunting for sheep's head today. That's the man right there teaching me how to fish at the coast today. This man right here says he's gonna break me a bass fishing if we get into some big fish down here at the coast. I don't know about that but that's the challenge for today. Stay tuned. What I gotta do here is catch the fish. Get untangled, step number one. All right. So you wanna look? The big ones are in there, they got a claw on them. I grabbed it by the claw. The claw was uh, itchy. I figured the it was. The one there in the bottom side, about middle of the way. Okay. You come out. About something like that, come out of the side. Because what a sheep here do, they'll come up and bite their legs off and okay. take the whole thing. Okay, so I might feel them bump it a few times. You, you, you'll have to get the hang of it. Uh, a sheep head's gonna knock it. Okay. When you feel a hard knock, that's a sheep head. Okay. You feel a doo -doo -doo -doo, it's probably a different kind of fish. Okay. Either way, I probably set the hook. So when I feel them donk it, I need to now set you'll the hook. get the hang of it when sheep head, a sheep head will hit it three times before it takes it. Okay. If you feel a good, a good donk, set it. Okay. I would just drop it down. You want to you want to get as close to the the shells on the pile on as you can. Okay. Oh, I just got hit. I got something. Sheep's head. Ha uh ha. -huh. First thing, huh, Randall? Good thing. Come here, big boy. Good thing. Yeah. Yeah, he took it. He kind of donked, donked it and then kind of felt like he was pulling on it the second time, so I just set the hook. Yeah, sometimes it will just sit there with Yeah, that's what I think he did. No, I'm trying not to. See, that's about perfect right there. Like about right here like a leg. Yeah, but where are you going in at? Right in the middle? Yeah, right in the middle. What I'm trying to do, and it ain't going in there too good. I usually go around the back side of it and go straight in. Come around the back side? Yeah. And go get them by the middle way. Right here? Go back some more. So you see that one thing they got right here? Yeah. See how that part right here is separate? Yeah. I usually go to that center plate and then just kind of about mid ways and just go to the, at an angle. This hook is so small, man. Oh, I see. I got you. I felt it that time. I felt it go in there and set. That's better. Oh, what you got? Oh, you got your one, didn't you? Good job, man. Huh? Yeah. Good job. Good job, man. <laughs> gotcha. Oh, yeah. That's 
That's a good size one, that's for sure. Oh, there we go. Oh, that's a good one. That's a real good one. Huh? Yeah, that's a good one right there. That's a good one guys, look at that. Good little sheep's head. Yeah. Wow. I know I'm gonna get them. Uh. <laughs> Keep working him, huh? You know what to Good and it's gracious. Oh, we son.
bottom of the pylon. Escape. Guys, we are getting to the end of an afternoon of fishing here down in Swansboro with Mr. RD here. He has put the hurting on me today with the sheep's head. I caught the first one and then he went into high gear and he caught pretty much all the rest of them. I did manage to catch a couple. Uh, caught a really nice black drum here just a few minutes ago that you guys saw. And uh, first black drum for you, right? Yeah, yeah first black drum uh, for RD and so uh, excited about that. That was a good fish of the day. We're going to keep fishing just a little bit longer here this afternoon. But, uh, using fiddler crabs today, fishing for sheep's head under the bridge down here in Swansboro. Sorry for the noise sitting under the bridge, but uh, it's kept us out of the rain today because it's been raining all day long. But thank you guys for watching. Uh, if you're new to the channel, hit like, hit subscribe, and we will catch you guys in the next video. Until then, get out fishing.